Alberta's premier has recently reacted to the uh, new ban on face coverings, the law that's in Quebec. At first, let me tell you a little bit about that. The law calls for a ban on any face coverings for people receiving a service from the state, from the government in Quebec, and proposes guidelines on how authorities should go about making accommodations based on religious beliefs and so on. And, and you know, in, in Quebec, it is so interesting to me that it happened there. I would have thought that it would have happened in Alberta or Saskatchewan in some western place where men were men and women are glad they were, right? But it happened out there and good for them. I mean, I congratulate them. And opposition parties in Quebec actually go on to say, hey, this actually doesn't go far enough to restrict noticeable symbols of all religions in the public space. Good for them as well. I mean, they've all come out of the ether. Austria recently became the fifth European nation to ban face veils. And, and then you roll into Alberta, where you have people that are so confused about life. The prime mistake is, you know, he's not in Alberta, of course, but, but I mean, he's federal, but he, and, and he's like so many other liberal politicians, they just don't get it. I, and what they're always saying, and back to Notley, she's saying, we must embrace, and, and you know, we have to treat everybody this wonderful way. What about us? I mean, we can't divide the population, Notley says. Well, you have divided it. All the Canadian people, you've pushed them away. And, and it's just wrong. And, and you've already brainwashed everybody into believing that they can't speak up, right? We've had that left-wing whip hitting us now for about 30 some odd years, and she's embracing that. She's pulling from the federal kind of thing that's been going on for so long. And now she's putting it into the woman thing. We're all against women because we won't allow them to cover their face. Really? Jesse James covered his face. I mean, come on. I, I, I mean, you walk into a place today and you get your check, your government check, and you're covered up and they say, show me your ID. And they say, no. Okay, here's your check, Mrs. Smith. Are you kidding me? I, I, you know what? <laughs> if you have a religious belief that calls for that, do it in your home or go back to your country that allows that. Don't come to our country and try to change all of us because I think there's a little bit of conversion stuff here too, isn't there? I mean, I don't know. Back to Notley. She goes on to say, this isn't nice because it marginalizes women. I didn't think it did. This has nothing to do with women. This has to do with people walking around looking like bank robbers in a country where that hasn't existed. And why would it now? It's about religion. Well, firstly, is Muslim hood stuff, is that a religion or is it a way of life? I mean, I, I don't know. I mean, it's not my place to sort that out. But, but you got to kind of not do this embrace uh, solidarity stuff all the time and don't divide people all the time and it's not just her it's all liberal people you have a united conservative party person here an mla leah somebody and she's the same so many of them are the same she goes on to say this leah person i agree with not in the quebec legislation it's ridiculous Actually, Leah, you're ridiculous because you're not paying attention to the people. You're part of them. You're the establishment. You're a politician. What about us? We don't want people walking around with their faces covered. Ugh. I mean, what's wrong with you bloody people? I mean, go hide somewhere. Get back into your closet. This is just bad. I mean, go out and talk to the real people and say, hey, would you like to have people walking around with their faces covered, walking into the bank and doing other silly things? The answer would be no. Do you hate them then? Yeah, you don't like women. How do you know it's a woman under there? I, you don't know anything. I mean, we don't hate anybody, except we do love, love embrace our way of life. Because we used to have one of them before you liberal wax came around and started trying to take it away from us. <clears throat> Y'all come back and watch more stuff here. All right for Alberta, all right for the world. And you know, there's right and there's wrong. And we're right. See ya.